Ian, thanks for joining us and welcome back to Port Road. First time for a long time, I think, but must bring back some good memories. Fantastic. I mean, uh, obviously, two of my favourite clubs, Ipswich and, and Leicester today, um, got a foot in both camps. So I hope maybe it's a draw. Uh, no one will be having a go at me today. But uh, no, it's wonderful to be back. Um, I love the place when I was here. Fantastic club, fantastic fans. It's, it's superb. Great relationship with Alex Matthew as well. He's got a few goals between you. Yes, we did. We had a good uh, understanding. Um, it's a shame, you know, obviously we, we dropped down into the Championship when we started off in the Premier League, but uh, we did form a good relationship and it was sad that we couldn't continue it. I mean, I was sort of like forced out the door when I, when I left. I didn't want to leave, but uh, that's football. Yeah, well, I mean, what are you? Is there any standout memories for you or is it just the club in general, really? No, the club in general. I mean, I got I remember scoring possibly one of my best goals against Charlton away, uh, where Milts uh, passed it to me, it fell over my shoulder and I volleyed it in. Uh, and that was probably one of my best goals I've ever scored. Obviously, I hold that record about the Premier League um, scoring in the first five games on a, as a debutant, which I still hold today, which is obviously a nice um, thing to have. But I, I, as I say, again, I just had wonderful times here. Loved playing for the club. It was a fantastic place to live. Um, you know, it's a wonderful part of the world. We were talking about your time at Leicester, because obviously it was a wrench to, to leave Ipswich, but Leicester opened up another career well, that for was, you. It was a great, you know, uh, even though I didn't want to leave, I went to Leicester and it, it turned out very, very well for me you know we won the league cup a few times